Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here and you found my channel because you were looking for a numbing cream for tattoos, for your tattoo, then welcome. I did previously post a video of the tattoo numbing cream from Tattoo Numbing Co. I'm pretty sure it's called. Um, that video got a few thousand views, which made me so excited because um, I don't usually get that many views on my videos, but I'm a fan of tattoos. If you guys haven't seen me, I am like very much um, covered, arms covered, neck, chest. Um, I just recently got my stomach done and um, I got a few right here and now I'm working on my legs. So I ran out last time of that other numbing cream. So I thought, heck, why not try out a new numbing cream for y'all who are interested. This is the Uber Numb Cream. I got this from Amazon. It's definitely a lot cheaper than the other numbing cream. So, um, but that numbing cream, so the difference between this one and that one that it's saying, so that tattoo numbing co cream or whatever, um, is, is meant, it's showing that it's meant to put on your skin prior to a tattoo. Um, before obviously you get your tattoo to numb the area you wrap it in your you know area and saran wrap that heat really like um locks in you know the cream or whatever and helps activate it that stuff is amazing go check that video out if you haven't checked that video out i love that stuff this stuff right here just like a few other things that i saw on amazon this isn't technically it is not saying it's for that this is for like the aftermath of a tattoo it says um, use for the temporary relief of pain and discomfort associated with, um, what's that word? Inorectal disorders. Um, their directions say adults and children 12 years or older for optimal results, cleanse the affected area with mild soap and warm water and rinse thoroughly, gently dry by patting or blotting with toilet tissue or a clean soft cloth before application that's product a product apply externally up to six times per day so you can i feel like this right here is saying that it's meant for um numbing the area like after you get your tattoo i'm not quite sure but i saw a video here on youtube and there was um, a few really good reviews on this for numbing the area of your tattoo i know you guys are watching this video to see if this works. Um, before I get into that, I do want to say this real quick. Tattoos do not hurt me. So I'm not one to be like, oh my gosh, I need a tattoo numbing cream in order to get through a tattoo. I can sit for a good solid eight hours, nine hours and be totally fine um, with my tattoo pain. I'm telling you right now though, that wasn't the experience with my stomach. I used that tattooed um, co like numbing cream Tattoo Numbing Co. I don't know how you say it. It's it's the one that I used previously. I update on that. I used that, you know, on my arm like I showed in the video. Like I got these tattoos right here and they did totally fine. But then I did my stomach and it did not really do anything at all, especially around the rib area. So if you are getting tattooed on your ribs, on your hip, on a very bony um, area like your um, your elbows, your knees, um, no matter what numbing cream you're going to use, that is by a bone, so that's going to be super sensitive. Um, products like this will kind of help numb it just a little bit, but I'm telling you from experience, anywhere near a bone or by like the armpit, it's just going to be a sensitive area regardless if you use a numbing cream. The numbing cream will like help numb it just a little bit, but you're still going to be like hurting because you have to think about that needle is like feeling like it's going straight into like a bone. So if you don't do well with tattoos and you're needing it to be numb, get it on an area where it's not going to be too painful. If you guys want me to do a video on um, posting like where my most painful tattoos were, where my least painful tattoos were, then comment down below and I would love to do that for you guys. So let's hop on in and trying this product out and seeing if it works. All right, so just like my other videos, I'm gonna go ahead and just apply it. So there was some left on the, the top, so we're gonna get every little bit we can. Go in, probably about half that much. And then really 
saturate the area. Oh, I found her scrubbing her feet. Nope, putting on lotion. Okay. How are you doing? All right, so I let that first layer soak in just a bit. Now I'm going to do one more layer. And then I'm going to put the saran wrap around it. If you have not seen my last video, like I suggested, um, I did the saran wrap because it really locks in the heat. And I, I do feel like that, that really helps. All right, so <clears throat> it's about an hour later. I took off the um, plastic wrap. Obviously from here and here, it's feeling a little tacky, but I'm like comparing it to this side of my leg and it feels a little numbing, but not like, I don't know how to explain it. It kind of feels like when you put um, the, what do you call that stuff? The icy hot or whatever, but I'm not getting the like, ice and hot like sensation so it kind of feels numb but it doesn't not feel as numb as the uh, tattoo numbing co cream that I used before so I'm very interested to see if this actually is going to numb the area and work or not All right, so it's time to give you guys the final review. And the only thing that I need to say about this product is it did not do anything. I didn't feel the numb in the beginning. I didn't feel it afterward and I didn't feel it during. This stuff did not work for me whatsoever, like one bit. I felt my whole entire tattoo, um, which in that area by the bone, um, was not really pleasant. The th thigh tattoo was totally fine, but the bottom of the leg, um, yeah, that was not, I think the older that I'm getting, the more I, my pain tolerance is kind of going downhill because I, I can sit for like a nine hour tattoo session to be totally fine. But I think in the last few years, I've realized that the tattoos are becoming um, a bit a bit more painful for me um, a lot of people look down on using numbing creams, but my thing is freaking use it if you want to use it. I don't think there's anything wrong with it. I've never had an issue with using a numbing cream and it affecting my tattoo at all. Um, the tattoo healed just fine and everything. Um, this stuff just did not do anything whatsoever. So with that being said, um, definitely go check out my other video. That um, numbing cream worked so much better, and I recently just tried out another one, so stay tuned so you can see that video. Um, these are probably going to be some of my favorite videos to, re um, to um, record because you guys have seemed to really find them helpful. Um, so yeah, I don't recommend this one. But everyone's skin is different. You can totally try it out if you want to. It might work for you. It, it worked for some, some people I saw do reviews on it. It worked for them, but it didn't do shit for me, so... Yeah. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in my next one. Toodles.